Kate's Witness News. Today, we'd like to share with you a special and interesting spot which most teenagers might not have explored yet. When I asked my friends what would they do after school, most of them replied that they would either play basketball or just chill out. However, I have a friend who has a unique hobby which she engaged in weekly despite her busy school schedule. Let's go find out what she does, as it might just be what you are looking for. here at Fuji Ice Palace. It's 8 o'clock now and it's freezing in here. And guess who's with us this evening? Wow, you're pretty good out there. When did you start ice skating? Oh, thank you. Um, I started last year, November, around there. Yeah. I see. Why ice skating? Um, because when I ice skate, I, it, releases, it releases all my stress and I feel that um, I have a lot of freedom to express myself. Can you tell us what your practice schedule is like? Um, I practice once to twice weekly for three to four hours. Besides ice skating, I also know that you are involved in many school activities like school council, netball and cross country. On top of that, you are also a triple science student. How do you cope and manage your time with so many commitments? Um, I have a, pla a timetable and I plan out and when it comes to study, I'll study and concentrate and not think about anything else and use my time wisely by not hanging out at the shopping centres and all this. That's a very good lesson to learn. Was there ever a time you wanted to give up ice skating? Yeah, sometimes it, certain tricks and stunts are like so difficult and you feel like you cannot do it and you'll feel like giving up but after a while when you just practice and practice and practice, you get the hang of it and you feel motivated to learn some more new things. Do you like to say a few words to the young potential ice skaters out there? Um, yes, I would like to say that um, they should, when they learn skating, just um, learn their basics very well, right? So when they, they go higher level, they don't need to learn the basics again. And most importantly, just enjoy and have fun. Thank you. Hi, um, Hi. Uh, Coach Raymond, I'm Michelle. Hi. Can I ask you a few questions? Yes, of course. With your experience, can you tell us what's a suitable age for learning ice skating? I have a student who is as young as two and a half years old, but, she, uh, but he is strong. You know, some kids are very strong when they're two and a half years old. But I think the best age to start is about four years old, where they are a bit more stronger. What does it take um, for people to learn ice skating as a uh, leisure? I call it ne energizer attitude, never say die. So you have to be strong. You you must not scared. Yeah, once you scared, you uh, you slow down your learning process. Yeah, that's the first thing. <clears throat> Second, you must have some kind of passion, some kind of interest in the sport. <clears throat> then you can uh, learn faster. Um. Lastly, I'd like to ask you. Currently, what is Vanessa's potential like? Ah, I see. Okay, actually she is quite a hard-working student. Yeah, and then the, her progress is quite good. In such a short time, she is learning at what she is now. Actually, it's quite good. Okay, thank you for your time, Mr. Raymond. Uh, yeah. It was a pleasure meeting you. You're yeah, welcome.